Okay, this is a worked example on intake design. The example says design a bill mounts intake for a city of 80,000 person drawing water from a channel which runs for 10 hours in a day with a depth of 1.8 meter. Also calculate the head loss in the intake conduit if the treatment plant is half kilometer away. Assume the following data. Average consumption per person equals to 150 liters per day. The velocity through the screen and the bell must to be less than 6 cm per second and such 2 cm per second respectively. Area occupied by the solid bar equals to 30% of the total area. Minimum water level at 0.3 meter below the normal water level. And also we need to keep the bottom of the screen at 0.2 meter above the channel bed. Okay, first let us calculate Q through intake. The yield charge equals 150 times 80,000 uh, 80, persons, which give us uh, 12, 12, uh, 12 million liters per day. Since the channel runs for 10 hours, let us, uh, let us divide the intake load per hour. So 12 million liters per day divided by 10 hours per day, it gives us 0 0.333 meter cubic per second okay area of course screen in front of the intake uh, will be calculated as area of area of the screen equals to discharge over the velocity through the screen so the discharge is already calculated which is 0 0.333 meter cubic per second divided by 0 0.16 meter per second which is given let's give us 2.0 at 3 meter cubic so uh, we already found the area of the scores screen in the front of the intake then let us let the area occupied by the solid bar be 30 percent of the total area which is with that that give us the actual area for the screen will be 100 percent minus 30 percent so it give us 70 percent so let us divide that area of screen by 70 percent so the actual area for for the screen equals to 2.083 meters meter square divided by 0 0.7 which is the 70 percent so it gives us 2.98 meter square let us achieve the minimum water level at uh, 0.3 below the normal level and let us keep the bottom of the screen at 0.2 above the channel width so let us calculate the available height of the screen uh, generally we can what we have to do is 1.8 which is the total depth minus uh, we need to add both 0.3 and 0.2 uh, it give us 1.8 minus 0.5 it give us 1.3 meter the required length of the screen equals to 2 point uh, length of the screen will be calculated as 2.98 divided by 1.3 it gives us uh, 2.98 meter square which is the area divided by the height which is 1.3 meter it gives us 2.29 meter it, approximately it is 2.3 meter so we need to provide a screen size of 1.3 meter by 2.3 meter so the design a bell mount entry so we need to design a bell mount entry or the we need to determine the diameter of the bell mount or the pipe so area of the area of the bill mode will be discharged over velocity of the bill mode so uh, discharge is 0 0.333 meter cubic per second divided by 0 0.3 uh, 2 meter per second which is velocity of the bill mode it gives us 1.042 meter square so diameter of the bill mode will be under root of 1.042 times 4 over pi uh, it gives us 1.15 meter so we need to provide a bill mode of 1.2 meter approximately 1.2 meter so design of intake conduit let us assume the velocity of 1.5 meter per second in the conduit so the design of the uh, the diameter of the intake will be under root of 0 0.333 meter per second times 4 divided by 1.5 which is the velocity of the conduit times pi it gives us 0 0.532 meter Okay, but let us provide 0 0.5 meter diameter in the conduit, which is approximately so. The actual velocity will be 0 0.333 times 4 over pi times 0 0.5 square. It gives us 1.7 meter per second. So 
also we are asked to calculate the hair loss so hair loss through the screen will be it has a formula for calculation of hair loss we can use this equation v equals to 0.849 cr under uh, raise of 0.63 s which is a side slope raised to 0.54 so c equals c it's a uh, it's a constant parameter for cast iron if the pipe or conduit is a cast iron with 1.30 for c and r is hydraulic radius d over for diameter over 4 so 0.5 over 4 which give us 0 0.15 then we need to substitute those things so substitute to the above equation so 1.7 equals to which is the equals to 0 0.84 9 times 130 times 0 0.15 raised 0 0.63 times side slope over uh, raised to 0 0.54 which is side slope we didn't know uh, the side slope for the for the what we need to calculate so we need to calculate s because we didn't uh, we don't know the value of s or the side slope so s equals to 4.98 times 10 raised to minus 3 after we simplify this equation s will it give us 4.98 times 10 raised to minus 3 so s is uh, s is uh, side slope which is hydraulic uh, hair loss over l so hair loss will be side slope times length which give us hair loss so we can uh, substitute this parameter into 4.98 times 10 raised to minus 3 times 0 0.5 times 1000 is give us 2.49 meters so 2.49 meters is the value of the head loss how we how did we how we get it head loss will be equals to uh, side slope times length length it's given so side size side slope we already calculated so side slope times length it give us head loss which which will be which will be 2.49 meters so 2.49 meters is the head loss not the side slope